Okay, so the box has suffered some damage in transit, but hopefully it's well packaged and uh, it will not have affected the parts inside. So let's see what we get inside the package. There we go. It looks like it's upside down, nothing else there. Beautiful package for my mini pepper four-legged robot. Let's see what's inside. So let's go. There you go. Nice. It's a little bit of more foam inside. So that is the blackberry pie. And there's also a kind of hat in here and a cable. See, this element is uh, it's not part of the normal Raspberry Pi. Some USB cables, more cables. That is some electronic here. Um, yeah, there's an electronic board and a cable there. Ah, that is the, uh, the, the game pad or the, the joystick to control. Looks cool, huh? Um, now, this is ah, fabulous. Brilliant. So, this is the lighter, okay? That was an, an option that I got on top of my mini puffer and here we have the box so um, SD card battery wow that's actually I'm impressed let's see custom uh, made battery um, this is the LCD apparently that's a small fan. You have here lots and lots of screws and standard parts. And this uh, is probably the servos. And that's a package of 3D printed parts. Let's see, these are the outer parts. The ones that are in bright yellow so this is a screwdriver <laughs> that's cool I, I didn't expect that that is a servo and these are the carbon fiber parts okay wow and that's a kind of assembly tool that comes with the package and uh, so this is the only one I didn't open it should be 12 of these servos so you have four here four here and four here that's correct and this one is the um, complementary one okay so let's put an order here okay so now that everything is sorted there is a lot of stuff here starting with the raspberry pi 4 uh, with a custom hat as we mentioned before this little fan, cables. These are the custom made servos, 12 of them plus one extra. Um, all the little uh, screws and bolts are nicely packaged in neat little bags with a label, which is really nice. I'm really impressed with the finish of the carbon fiber parts really very good this beauty here is the rp lidar that doesn't come as a standard it's an extra that you can order on top the joystick as i said it's not a branded one but it looks nice um, this is the battery that was also unlocked as part of the um, kickstarter campaign um, it's custom made battery and it looks awesome. 
Yeah, it has a little power button here. Let's see how this works. This little um, board looks to me like a power control board. The I'll need to check these in the bill of materials. You get all the little yellow uh, 3D printed parts. Some of them have a really nice finish. Well, this one actually is not 3D printed at, at all. I think I think this is. These are not 3D printed. The ones that are 3D printed, I would say, is this one, uh, and it shows because the finish is not as good as the other ones. The other ones are just molded, normal mold. These ones are 3D printed. These are the black ones, which are more structural, look like. These are the feet, also 3D printed. Um, you get as well the LCD. Um, and you get all these beautiful little bearings, which I've read are not necessarily easy to fit. We will see how this goes. So, lots of stuff. I'm looking forward to dive in and see how this all fits together. So join me in the next video for the assembly of the mini puffer. See you.